Hi, everybody. It's me again. I'm uh, going to talk to you for a minute about your favorite subject, two-way communication logs and people accounting. Well, I got some good news and I got some bad news. So let's start out with the good news. The good news is we do have word, and I will send out the document in a little bit, that we can have our special ed folks communicate with our general ed folks and so if they came in person to person, they can share that with the general ed folks and we can count a P for that particular day, um, which in this particular case, is, case our in-persons are Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. I know we're all doing Mondays and uh, Wednesdays for the most part, but you might be able to pick up um, some additional help with that. So that's the good news. The tough news is that regarding the L's, the log entry where you have to have an assignment turned in and you have to have responded to it, well now what they want us to do is to have recorded that assignment somewhere and that it is accessible via the two-way communication log. Now before you panic, Sarah Taylor, Allison Bangle put together a nice easy way of doing this. And we will also have Vicki Wenslick, who's going to be coming back to work tomorrow, working on this to help us out. So I'm going to share my screen real quick. And kind of show you, hopefully this will help, what we're talking about. So you're all familiar with this area here. These are our two-way Wacusta Mentor Logs. Well, now there's one more additional piece up here and I will just simply click on it, and you will see everybody's name here, okay? Now, the least thing that you have to do is, let's say that Mr. Groves is in Mrs. Barnes' um, beginner garden class, okay? Mrs. Barnes opens up her file, or she opens up her folder, and we will go ahead and drag in Mr. Groves' assignment for that day. If you click on it, you will see test assignment for Mr. Groves and Mrs. Barnes BK class. That's pretty easy. So once that's done, now it's in that log assignment. Now, what you can do as a teacher or what Vicki Wenslick is gonna to do to help you out is that she will be going in to these log assignments each day and she will click in, she'll go by each teacher She'll see this assignment, test assignment for Mr. Groves. We wanna just make sure that the student's name on it. That's, that's the biggest thing. And then she will go ahead and get a link. Now she's got a link, okay, got it. Copy link, link copy, done. Now they'll go back to our mentor log pages. Mrs. Barnes' class will be clicked on. We'll go to the appropriate log entry for that student. If it was Mr. Groves, Mr. Groves would be here and she will simply go into the activity. You could put Seesaw and then let's say this is Mr. Groves. She would go ahead and she would paste, or I'm sorry, insert the link right there. Now it's all available and it's safe. So it's one extra step for you. Um, not the greatest news that I wanted to share with you today, but I think we came up with a pretty flawless uh, system that'll work out and you know you can communicate with Vicki if you wanna do those links yourself or um, if you just trust, just dumping them in there, she will make sure that those are done each day. Hopefully that helps. Um, great day today with the pickups. Lots of excited kids, good pumpkin carving contest, all those other good things. That's my message for today. Hope you're all doing well. Talk to you later.